those of us who've been traumatized by the mental health system, I was forcibly drugged, I was labeled, I was put in solitary confinement, I was called schizophrenic. How many folks have been traumatized by the mental health system itself? The mental health, the healing system has traumatized us. There's a special kind of uh, way to help reach those of us who've been traumatized by the mental health system. Because who do you turn to for help, right? If you're overwhelmed by the mental health system, who do you turn to for help? The mental health system, right? So it's, 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 so oppressed people, we tend to hurt each other sometimes, okay? And the, the, a, lot of, a lot of marginalized communities are dealing with this. A lot of oppressed and marginalized communities are dealing with this. That there's a prison rights organization right here in Portland. And just real briefly, when I went to one of their seminars, and what they'll say when they come to mental health is, and mental health, we need diversion programs, we need more money for mental health for prisoners. And I went to them and said, hey, I want to warn you guys, there's a, the prison, the prison industry is being mined by the pharmaceutical industry. It's becoming the chemical prison industry. We just had a member kill himself, uh, Michael Heston, who for years wrote us compelling letters. We have a number of them on our website, on our main homepage about the next forced drugging, the next forced injection. And, uh, and, and, and eventually he, he was killed. Now he, was, he, he, had, he had committed crimes that were, that were bad, uh, but, but he didn't deserve uh, torture. And that's what forced drugging is. And so, yes, we, yes, we need to hurt that. Yeah, I'm not pro or against medication. I really believe in choice. Reading the medications that they had me on and the labels, that they put on me, it labeled my soul again. And I'm really, really reached a point where I want to change that for others again. I don't want to see those labels on people's souls.